now we are coming to the skills needed for good prompting that is about good prompting develop your writing and communication skills understand how language models work actually this is a little this repetition practice creativity and learn and understand a little technical skills wherever possible this is a very important thing six incorrect ways of prompting what are the ways we should not prompt that is what we are going to explain here it is giving a very broad or vague prompt if chat gpt can't understand or it is too vague with uh, uh, jumble junk with, uh, with uh, uh, wrong word order this we need to understand important thing is when we use our own mother tongue indian mother tongue to english sometimes we translate verbatim and we may not use the word order so if we use a wrong word order or by mistake a wrong phraser verb then chat gpt can understand think that it is very vague or i will tell you an example just if we say that a write a story it's a it's very clear but it is very broad chat gpt cannot immediately at least we have to write as i was telling earlier write a story about a girl uh, experimenting in a graduation chemistry lab doing a salt analysis even if we like that it will give us a story but if we just write write a story it is not going to do then use using a too specific prompt so for example write a story about a single musician who lives in a big city and wears the same shirt daily while having 30 other different types of colors at home if we give such a stringent thing we may not get we may not get but we need to give sufficient room for generative ai to use its imagination or to use its own searching or that or that generation then second a third one is providing too much context in the prompt <clears> or <throat> fourth one is using overly complex or technical language in the prompt these are all the things we need to understand from the background that even chat gpt is very young it is like it is a, like a one year old boy or girl so how much we can how much we can expect from this so so therefore we need to understand these limitations while making a prompt one good thing is that we follow the structure what is given start with the structure and improve upon that using then asking a question that can't be answered with available information means chat gpt always says that i can answer only only about the things till september 2021 afterwards chat gpt is not trained so if we ask chat gpt who won the world cup a uh, world cup there in qatar chat gpt doesn't know and using excessively long prompts long prompts will take uh, it will really spoil the show